This video podcast will discuss how special education teachers can prepare for an upcoming redetermination conference. By now you have read the special education handbook section on redetermination conferences and are familiar with the process. As you know, we hold the redetermination conference around the second anniversary of the child's eligibility date. So it will take place about one year prior to the eligibility actually expiring. When thinking about your caseload, it's best practices to start this process about two months ahead. There are three steps to this process, consent, data collection, and school psychologist. You can remember this by the mnemonic, can dog sit, with the C, D, and S at the beginning of each word, standing for those three steps. First, you need to obtain consent by having the parent or guardian sign the consent for data collection. This form can be found in the special education handbook. After consent has been obtained, the next step is the, to collect the needed data for the redetermination. The purpose of the redetermination is to decide, as a committee, if there's enough data to determine the child continues to meet special education criteria. It is the special education teacher's responsibility to gather this data and present it to the committee. The needed data will vary depending on the student and the eligibility category. However, some of the pieces of data would include an updated social history form, a hearing and vision screening, classroom grades, district testing scores, previous eligibility report, and special education psychological evaluation report. The last step in preparing for the redetermination process includes the school psychologist. Two to three weeks prior to the meeting date, the special education teacher should submit this data packet to the school psychologist. The school psychologist will then review the data and make a recommendation regarding the student's redetermination. These are the steps for a special education teacher to follow regarding the redetermination.